It's a brand new week, so of course we have a brand new episode of 360 Daily for you to bring you everything that's trending in fashion, beauty or lifestyle. On today's episode, find out more on Tommy Hilfiger's Fruit Fiber Sneakers. Catch up on all the glitz and glamour from the figure K8 pageant. Know more on Rihanna's Fenty Beauty TikTok house. And last but definitely not the least, LeBron James' stand on NBA's decision over coronavirus. First off, on was trending North Face enlist Jess Glein for Women's Day product campaign. English singer and songwriter Jess Glein is making her first appearance as an ambassador for the North Face alongside a cast of female explorers. The group has been enlisted to star in a campaign for International Women's Day, presenting a collection that has been both designed and manufactured by all female teams. Captured by British photographer and filmmaker Holly Marie Cato, the campaign shares stories of remarkable women, including freeride world champion Marion Hartie, London-based adventurer Sophia Jean, and stunt actress Marie Morum. Every woman in the group has challenged the status quo and pushed the boundaries for women, be it music, arts, business, or sports, the North Face said. The collection spanning t-shirts and tote bags was made at an all-female factory in Jordan. More than 500 women work at the Jerash Garen factory, which was founded by Oriana Aweshe to provide more opportunities for women and their families. On the Spotted segment today, we have celebrities at Figure k 8s beauty pageant. The maiden edition of the Figure k 8 pageant founded by Nollywood actress Kate Henshaw may serve to promote authenticity and help young women accept their melanin skin. But there was also plenty happening in the fashion stakes on Thursday evening. Hosted by Lala Akindoju, Nollywood stars brought the usual glamour to the red carpet with their stunning ensembles. Celebrities such as Chigo, Adunia Day, Iniado, Linda Osifo, Tolubali, Dayo Amusa, Faithia Balogu, Nancy Sime, RMD, Hilda Dokubo, Rita Dominic, Sound Sultan, and Omomi were spotted amongst others in style. On today's beauty segment, Rihanna opens the official Fenty Beauty TikTok house. TikTok is quickly becoming one of the go-to social media platforms for all things beauty, and Rihanna, ever the trendsetter, knows something big when she sees it. That's why the musician and creator of the widely successful Fenty Beauty line is making it even easier for creators to share their love of Fenty with a brand new Fenty Beauty TikTok house, a destination for all things stunner lip paint, match sticks, and killer watt highlighter. According to Days, Rihanna debuted the new TikTok house in LA and it comes complete with a pool and tons of video-ready natural lights and mirrors. We are standing in the official first Fenty Beauty TikTok home, she announced at the unveiling. I just wanted to create a platform for the next wave of content creators. I think our generation is the sickest, the illest, and the most creative. I can't do it alone, so to join in with the people who are influencing the world and my community and my generation, this is a help. That's a really smart business invest investment by Rihanna. Incredibly smart. First off, on editorial segment, Sam Rollinson on the cover of Bergdorf Goodman. Sam Rollinson poses on location in Los Angeles, California for Bergdorf Goodman magazine's Spring 2020 cover. Photographed by Boo Greeley, she wears a lox ensemble from Dres Van Norton. Accompany images show elegant designs for spring, including dramatic gowns as well as colorful suiting. Styled by Ethel Park, Sam wears models like Valentino J. Mendel and Badgley Mishka. <music> On our Spice You're Not segment, you are savage in ripped denim pants. Giving us a lesson in laid-back Lagos style, Tiwa Savage headed to the streets over the weekend wearing ripped denim pants and a green bustier and a Jacquemus mini bag. She then completed her look with matching square toe heels that match the bag and large hoop earrings. A classic Tiwa Savage take on off-duty or errant fashion, this unnamed ensemble is a topper and a great way to revisit the ripped look trend. It's also perfect for sunny and hot weather. But let us know what you think. Is it spicy or not? <laughs> it's a wrap for today's episode of 360 Daily. Thank you so much for tuning in. But don't forget to find out more. You can visit our website at www.myspice.tv or our social media handle, which is Spice TV Africa across all platforms. Until next time, my name is Valerie. Thank you for watching.